So this is what I look like right now. A little heavy. 200 pounds. 200 pounds I let myself get to after cutting down to 180 before the last Spartan races. And uh, I just had COVID when I got back. And then the boys moved in and I got sick. Inconsistency in training, kept my calories high, indulged a little too much. You know, life, life happened. We got these coming up and we have to get back in shape. It's time to get back after it. We have about uh, three months until Killington. That is enough time to do a, a good prep with a decent base that we have from the last one. So I'm not super worried, but now it's time to start getting after it and uh, be very careful. So we have to be very cautious of what we eat, tracking my calories every day again, and uh, making sure we don't miss workouts and uh, should be good. And we'll have to do a little extra. We're gonna, just to build the mileage up quickly and safely, I'm gonna be riding my bike to and from work most days. And uh, that should, that should help me bring up the mileage fairly quick. And uh, that's it. So this morning we got some sprint work, three by, three by five minute sprints with two minutes of walking. And then we have some deadlifts and core and carry stuff. So it should be a good workout. But like I said, let myself go. It happens, it happens to all of us. I just, life got caught up. We were so busy. I'm not a professional athlete and I don't claim to be. But I do like to be competitive, and so now it's time to start getting after it and uh, get back on track. So that's what we're going to do today. Ah, what's up, everybody? Just finished up my run. I had to switch it up from the sprints this morning. My treadmill wasn't working, so no uphill sprints, but 35-minute easy run. Uh, pretty good. Lungs had some crap in it still. <coughs> still pretty snotty, but I was holding a pretty decent pace. I think my... My average pace was 8.13 minutes per mile, 82 cadence. I did about 4.2 miles, so not too bad. Hit a little bit of trails. Just start building up. That's all it is, it's consistency now. So the fitness is there. We just got to get it back. Let's go eat. So this is my breakfast. Bagel with two pieces of Canadian bacon, as they call it here. Bowl of... Uh, Greek yogurt with some almonds, some honey, and some banana. And then water, lemon, and I usually throw in some light show to replenish my electrolytes after a workout. And there's a tiny bit of honey to add some sweetness in here. And that's what I'll eat, and I'll post the, the calories up here somewhere. Just biked home. A nice uh, 10.25 miles. It took me 41 minutes. Not too bad, I think that's the fastest I've ever made it home. Now we're gonna have a quick uh, pre-workout snack and then come in down to the gym with the boys and get a workout in. Ooh. Cheers. 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 Started this morning off a 35 minute zone two run because I couldn't get the treadmill to work. Uh, funny enough, Alan, uh, my son, one of my sons, got the treadmill to work during our second workout this evening. Uh, I biked home from work, which was 10 miles. And then we did a 48 minute uh, Metcon and strength work. So some pull-ups, deadlifts, 
uh, Zetcher lunges. I didn't film those. I got some deadlift footage, which you saw before this. And uh, my boys joined me. It was awesome. They did some of the work. And then we did a Metcon with uh, 60 seconds of Russian twists, single arm dumb, uh, deadlifts, 60 second wall sits, followed by a 400 meter run for four rounds. It was good to get back into it. I felt better today just doing the workout and just getting after it again today. So that was the update on the day. I'll try to keep you guys updated as much as possible. Um, it was pretty awesome. My boys wrote my workout for me. I'll post that right here. And uh, yeah, man, just we're finally getting into a rhythm, getting into a flow, and that's kind of nice. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good night. I'm going to go eat dinner with my family. Peace.